has come to our family. Welcome back to our second video for a Darkest Dungeon playthrough. We have just defeated the me the Necromancer for level one. Hell yeah. He was a tough little dude. He was, tough. he was a tough little dude. 77 hit points. 77 hit points. Now, the way things usually go, you were just talking about this a few minutes ago, the more hit points they have, usually the less bad stuff they have on them. No. We looked at the boss that we're headed for right now. He has fewer hit points. <laughs> he does. So, uh, we'll see how that works out. But we're starting off this one in the hamlet because we just finished defeating the Necromancer. So we're coming back to the hamlet and we're going to gear up for our first level two dungeon. So let's go ahead and hit the ground running. I'm Sam. JT. Yeah, we... Almost forgot that, but yeah, it's all good. There you go. All right, so what are we doing here, man? First thing we got to do is, uh, gonna do is flip that bit. event card. So here we go. Uneventful week. Nice. The most exquisite news to have a week without Not any news. All right, like so that. we do have three days, though, so that's pretty good. Three days to prepare. That helps. Uh, where is our gold? What did we have? We had 20... Oh, uh, let's see. We had 37 gold. 37? 37, 37 gold. I want the hard mode. It's about, you know, 10, 10 days, you know, 10 gold a week. All right. 37 10, 10 gold. gold a day. That's not bad. Okay. Um, so we're technically still at the end of Act 1, mm -hmm. so we still can't use the graveyard. Dun, dun, dun. Necromancer's there digging his own grave. Yep, of course he is. Because we told him to. Because <laughs> uh -huh. we whooped him. Alright. Okay, so uh, we do have Survivalist 2 left over, uh, which allows us to uh, gain one uh, provision die for one dollar or or one gold, or two, two extra provision dice for three gold. So that is a, a possibility. But uh, I have a lot of wounds. You have a lot of afflictions. I have a whole bunch of these bad guys. You have guys. a whole bunch of those. A fourth one, and you're going to go crazy. So but we have first to... of all, I got to turn in this affliction. Ooh. And take a negative quirk instead. Can I just turn in my my? Uh... And I can flick this thing over. Can I just turn in my my disease? Sure. It'll cost you <laughs> two gold. Okay. Well, we got to roll this though to see where we can't we go. Right. Yeah. We well, we the, already have the, the graveyard mouse. knocked out by the necromancer. We also. There Number he is four. again. Four. We cannot we go to the sanitarium. Disease. Again, healing and disease removal. Wow. Anything else you like? Snot no. buckets. We do need to do some upgrades. Um, yes. Cut. Yeah, we do. We so use yeah. XP. We use XP, which we and all have for that. XP. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Vestal should have five. So let me ask this: Are there are there rules like you can't upgrade to a level three until you are level three? You can't have That's a right. level two you, until you are level two, right? Yep. You get a fourth slot basically when you're level two. Got it. And a fifth slot when you're level three. Yeah. But as far as the skills go, you can have a level three skill on a level one character, mm -hmm. or five level one skills on a level three character, for that matter. I wonder. See, I've got five. Experience. You do need to get rid of those quirks, though. I do. So, 
Um, First and foremost, before the grounds Abby. goes there. Yep. All right, so I'll go there. Um, should I spend five gold to get rid of two of them? Yes. All right, right, so I think I should get rid of the ones that cause stress the most. Um, so when you take stress, you're going to take a damage per hero level, or you're just going to get a bunch more stress. Yeah, I think that's good. Honestly, taking light and stress isn't that much, because we don't raise the torch a ton. Right. It might be a couple of... That might be a better one to keep. Yeah. I do too, because this is giving me damage, that's giving me more stress, this is giving me more damage when I get stressed, yeah. so I think take that out of that synergy and I think we'll be good. So, removed two negative quirks. We'll shuffle them back in there in a second. Okay. Okay, so that was his turn. Yep. Highwaymen. Cannot um, heal. Can't heal. Um, he has the disease, can't, rid of, can't get rid of the disease either. He's not really doing too terribly bad on stress. Um, should I should I upgrade him? I think we should try to upgrade somebody every turn to a level we can. To, to level two, not just not Either just or, yeah, or skill level cards. two would give you a lot more health. I think it gives you more dodge, maybe. So that costs us four gold and three XP. Um. Yep, let's do it. I think we need to level up some people. There are some things, when you're level 2, you get more health. Um, he probably, like I said, he gets so, more dodge, more health. Yeah, he gets one more dodge, he gets five more health. Yep. He has another resistance to bleed instead bleed. of just stun. Mm -hmm. His Hamlet skill is the same, though, but now he has two slots for uh, trinkets. trinkets instead of just one. So that's a pretty good thing, I think. We'll yeah. do that. So, so Highwayman is level two, and that's four gold. Right. Give me two experience back. And then uh, on top of that, you can. Um, no, what was I just going to say? Oh, yeah, you can slot a fourth skill. Yeah! Level two, baby! Okay, so Highwayman go here, level up. Um. The other thing is, is being level two, there are some differences in the dungeon, which we'll talk about when we get there. But you take more damage from <laughs> a couple of different things. See how he talked me into that, folks? <laughs> Isn't that great? I'm leveling up next. I hope, <laughs> unless you keep hogging it. No. Um, okay. So stress-wise, I'm doing okay. Um, we don't really want to buy trinkets right now. We don't have enough gold. I mean, yeah, we don't have enough gold. We might do want to do an upgrade instead, but. Um, I don't have a lot to do. I could draw. I might just take her over. You know what I think for now, because I don't really have a lot of good options. I am going to take her over here, spend a gold um, to heal three stress, which isn't a ton, but that'll work. And then for the Vestal, um, if I place her here to chant, we all lose one stress. We all won? All of us. One? And we all get a buff for three turns. I this, like that chanting. She's good at chanting. I like she it. She is chanting. I'll buy her lonesome over here. So, buff for three. Dude, his level twos are pretty. You don't get a level two, though. You just get a level one. Oh, why did you, you tell me? You gotta pay for that, too. You gotta pay for it? Yeah. I just did. Almost. <laughs> okay, day one done. We'll go to day two. These are definitely not as good. No. All right, day two. We are going to roll this. Move him to... Look at that. He's taking the Abbey over. Snapper doodle. And we have 27 left. 27 left. Okay. Well, um... You're you need to you're pretty much yeah. I need to I need to heal. Yeah, I want to get rid of these hopefully, but I can't do it this round. Okay, well I'm gonna go to the sanitarium and pay three. Uh, to also heal. need to get rid of a disease. Heal ten. Okay. Oh, sorry. The ten went right there. Okay. I also just for ease of play, I gave you a hit point pool over there. Oh, look at you thinking outside the box. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> okay. All right. So you went there. Highwayman gets to go. 
Uh, highwaymen. I'll stay away from here so that you can get one of your other people there. Mm -hmm. um, maybe the highwayman comes over to the survivalist. Gets a couple extra yeah. provision three. dice. So that's three. So that's three bucks. Two and more two more yeah. dice, yeah. Okay. So then I'm going to take the grave robber and go here. Spend three XP. These are with four and four gold. And she's going to level up to level two as well. Which takes her dodge from one, hit points from 11 to dodge two, hit points 15. She now has resistance to debuffs. And I get a slot of fourth skill. And a second trinket. Okay, and then for the Vestal, again, she's kind of left out of the party. Um, man, oh man. That's your choice, man. She's last. She gets no love. Just mm -hmm. like last. You could have had. Act one, she got no love. Now you she gets could no have love had again. the Grave Robber go pull a, a, a treasure, but no. I could have. I could have. Um... You know, she's not in bad shape. She just needs to go here next, hopefully. So that's all she's waiting for. So she's going to go here. Get rid of some stress. Spend another. She is stressless. <laughs> okay. All right, we're back. Day mm -hmm. number one day left. Uno. And don't roll a four. One. No survivalist. Oh, that kind of sucks, too. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Okay. So I've got 16 left. Oh, 16 I need left. to remove two quirks with her. You need to remove a disease with him. The other so two can do seven. whatever. The other two can do some. You should do some. Upgrade him, you think? Either that or drop your stress. He's at six Minus right six. now. Hmm. I think we'll be all right with stress. He's he's one of those guys. He's a go-getter. He, he likes to live on the edge. Right. He's a donkey on the edge, man. All right. Um, so I think we're going to go upgrade him to a, a little... donkey on the edge. I don't even know what that means, a donkey <laughs> on the edge. That's from Shrek, Are man. Are you leveling him up to two? Huh? Yes. To two. I'm going to level him up to, to two. See what goodies we get here. All right, so he actually has a dodge now. Dude's got 24 hit points, man. He's going to need them. <laughs> he can it's still only move one, though. He has resistances to uh, stun, and that's being buffed, right? Uh, yeah, he has resistance to being buffed as well. So He's too hardy. He's too sturdy to want an advantage in battle. He wants to be straight up. That's right. There's something wrong with that. <laughs> All right, so that took, uh, upgrade my hero card, that took three XP, so I'll need two back when you get a chance. Okay. <clears throat> oh, man, I'm feeling good now, three out of 24? Let's bring it. Yeah, here's your two XP. Thank you, sir. All right. Disease removal squad. Disease removal, yep, we need to go there. That's two gold. Uh, that's right here. Move disease. So no more. So no, no longer lethargic. So he's not going to take uh, damage when he moves. So, so that's a good thing. Yeah. <clears throat> mm. It's pretty tough. I'm going to take pick in the face. I don't know if it'll help me or not, but I'm going to take it anyways. Pick in the face. Pick to the face. Pick to the face. That's the that's one of the best ones out there. You had it last time. I, I, I don't know. Did I not put out the right ones? Nope, that's good. No, I just uh, picked my fourth skill. Cool, cool. Alright, so for her, well, she'll wait. For her, she's gonna go get rid of two quirks for half hard moolah. Goes fast. No longer mm -hmm. an anemic bad gambler. <laughs> Which means I'll go a little I bit. Stopped drink hey, what did we get this for? That's from when she did her prayers. Everybody Ooh. has a buff of three. And then for her, I think I would have gone there. She doesn't need to worry about stress. So she'll go here. She gets to draw a chest. 
which isn't much, but we'll take one of those anyways. And, uh, oh, so do I take a dice on any face I want, or do I take two times gold? Well, we're pretty much We better done. take a dice on any face yeah, we got, huh? I think okay. so. Alright. So, I'm going to leave it on that face for a minute. So there. Okay, we can put that away. Cool, cool. Alright, so we are done in the Hamlet. So here we go. We are headed into the dungeon, level two, and our boss is the Fanatic. Now the Fanatic says, You've braved one threat, yet another one more ominous plagues our land, bringing fear and despair to the Hamlet's folk in the face of the Fanatic, a firebrand zealot whose conviction turns people into heretics, worthy to be burned at the stake. This self-appointed judge, jury, and executioner would gladly incinerate the hamlet and all who reside here in order to save their souls. Such a threat cannot be endured. Venture forth into the ruins and deliver us from the fear that grips everyone's hearts. So that's the fanatic. He's a nasty little dude. This dude... While we're in the dungeon, when a battle starts, all heroes suffer three marked tokens. Yep. So for three turns, we're going to be marked in each battle. So pretty much every battle, we're always going to be marked. Yep. That's pretty nasty. Um, then in the Hamlet, every time a hero uses a Hamlet skill, they suffer. F- <laughs> they suffer four debuff. Yep. My goodness. Who picked this? No, I'm sorry. Your Hamlet <laughs> skill is your personal skill, by the way. Yeah, it is. So, so but still. That's, you might just hang out in town. You used, you used yours twice, used didn't you? that one and that one. That one and that one, yeah. So, hmm. All right. All right well, we got our dungeon. Yep. Oh, we need our little shield. Our little party. Right in the middle. We got a very interesting dungeon this time. Mm-hmm. Everything's connected. <clears throat> and uh, here is our quest. Go for it. As the, uh, it's called disruption. As the cult's ominous rituals taint the halls of the ruins, dark gods begin to converge over the estate. This cannot be left unanswered. Delve deep into their lair and put an end to the cultist rituals once and for all. Right. Special rules are objective rooms are rooms four and eight. Pick one at random each time you enter. Set them aside at dungeon start. You won't use them during other encounters. So we got to take rooms four and eight and put them aside right now? Yeah, except for the other side is another dungeon. So we we'll just it. remember. Okay. We just can't use them in any of these. So if we pull four or eight, we'll go to the next one. Understood. All and right. Then for We have three objective rooms in there, which are the purple uh, scrolls. Mm-hmm. So for every one of those we clear, we get an XP. XP. All right. So we can leave anytime we want. Which might be pretty close. Might be right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. And we are ready to. Okie dokie. Shovel. Some more Anna Venom. We like two Anna shovels. Venom. Look at that. Two choices and one torch and a food. Oh, not so bad. That is we actually have another a good choice. Roll. So here's more shovels. More shovel. Lots of shovels. And three choices. So we'll put a torch. That'll give us two torches. Or we'll maybe another one. Another torch. Yeah. Another torch. And, and what do we light on? We're lighting on food. Or food. Probably food. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Let's do food or a torch. Who needs to eat when you're in a dungeon? Okay. Oh. All right. So a couple of things now that you're level two. Um, your hunger and your rubble when you roll them on here are now more dangerous to you. So instead of one and one, it now does two and two, two stress and two damage. And instead of two damage, it now does four damage. Because you were that much hungry. Because you're level two. Yeah, you're bigger. Yeah. You need more protein. Yeah. The other thing is, since we're in a level two dungeon now, we're in act two, level two dungeon, um, the traps do more damage. Uh, or the trap rooms do more damage. Why is everything getting and, harder? Uh, well, that's kind of the way it works. I think that's pretty much it. 
Well, one thing to note, in the last game, when we went to a trap room, I had us take two damage each. We should have only taken one damage each, so the traps are a little bit more difficult Bro. than they should have been. After building you up as one of them people that just one knows this game back and forth. Come on. All right, yeah, that's true. You did pretty good. All right, we'll anyways, ready to scout? Yes, sir. Right on. I'm not stressed. Um, Crusaders <laughs> it's a living that stressful life, you know? Mm -hmm. All right, we're scouting. So we have one encounter room there. Oh, we have another one there. And we have, oh, oh I'm sorry. Wait, wait, yeah, we can't do it. Cheating? This Look one. Look at you, yeah, that one. Oh, Look at that. There's <laughs> our three rooms. <laughs> we just knocked it's completely it out of the park. <laughs> we got to destroy those three rooms. Oh, yeah. All right, so we're going Let's up go. first. Going up first. All right, here we go. So this is for the highwaymen. Hey, yeah, baby. And Crusader. Oh. oh, look at that. I got two stressful darknesses. So I got one. Okay. Starting with Crusader, you got to burn a torch, take two stress. Or drop, no, our, I ain't or drop no our light level. He's one. stressful as it is. We don't want to stress. You, do we want to get the plus one crit, though? Yeah, well, that's, that's fine for now. You want to do that? Yeah. All right, so we dropped it. There we go. And this Nothing guy doesn't there. get anything. All right, so we drop it again or take two stress. I guess I will take two stress on each. I'd like to use those for cure. Man, you guys went to a spa or something. We did. We're hanging Bad out. gum. You're just like chilling. Okay. Okay. So we're there. Now we need a random four or an eight. There's an eight. And since it was the first one I pulled, we'll do that one. Okay. Right on. Hmm. Okay. So now we took every um Every level one creature that the Necromancer didn't kill is in this pile. Oh, wait a minute. So we're not even using this right now? We're not. Not for the not for these. Got it. Okay. 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 Got it. So just Understood. specifically we have to defeat the room. So this doesn't do that special thing There's that it did not. last time. No. Sweet. Alright, cool beans. So um but every level one creature that was left from all the ones that the Necromancer killed last time um has now been mixed in with a bunch of level two creatures. So the Necromancer is going to have lasting effects on our campaign because he culled a lot of level 1s out of here for us. Yeah, which means we have a higher chance of hitting more level 2s. Like that giant which, ghoul. Yeah, we thought, it was pretty, we thought it was pretty cool that he was knocking people out of the campaign, but so we're actually going <laughs> to... So we're starting out with a level 2 ghoul. <laughs> oh, dear. Now, he can't be in two places at once, right? So does he, he go wherever the yeah, aggressive, the aggressive stance, stance is? Stance, okay. Yeah. A bone defender. I won't say it. I, I was going to uh, say bone defender is ready, but I said it a lot last time. <laughs> I'm editing it, you so... Can do it. I'm not going to do it. I don't want to say the joke uh, too much. There's the bone defender. I think I, I think I probably did say it too much. Last yeah. time. So, Bone Defender comes up here. He's pretty nasty. Uh, the ghoul, however, goes right here. And, and you know what? That's kind of bad because our two weakest characters are going on that side of the board right next to him. Who you call a weak? Well, as far as... I mean... Yeah. Who are you calling weak? I, like as far as healing is concerned, you rock. Now, the Grave Robber... Maybe. That's 26 hit points, though, There's man. partner here. 26 and hit points. These two people come over here. Why am I already hurt? No, I think kidding. she needs to stay over here in the corner. There's no connection. Just so two, you know. I'm just saying, do some <laughs> chanting over here in the corner. Because right. don't peek around. She'll get scared. Okay, so the, We'll get scared, too. The ghouls are only level 2. He's got 26 hit points, 2 movement, and some nasty damage. Wow. That is not okay. I will be showing that card. To who? So everybody <laughs> can see it. This is the guy who killed us. <laughs> All right, Crusader. Oh, yeah. Crusader is still slow as crap. So he got a speed stone? He does have a speed stone. And that will allow him to get up there. 
and I will zealously accuse folk. So I will use the speed stone and allow me to move two. And oh wait, I don't want to peek around that corner. <laughs> you do. You need to. Okay, you got twenty four hit points. You go totally. -to I know. I do. I got twenty one hit points, sir. Oh, sorry. Because I didn't get all healed up, but I did heal up most of it. All right, so we're gonna do here. Zealously accuse this bad boy of being such a nasty person. Uh, so we've got. Yep, that's the only thing I can do. Well, like, yeah. Accuracy nine. What in That's the world? That's a nice miss. What okay. in the world? I don't know if you noticed, but not only the ghoul, or not only the bone defender, but the ghoul we both have armor too. <laughs> what goodness. So that's half damage. Oh. So not only does it have 26 hit points, yeah. it's going to do half, it's taking We're half taking damage half the damage. entire time. Yes. And we forgot to do the marked things. Oh, yeah. So. Everybody it's has like three marked each. Three Although, marks each. In this particular battle, no extra damage to marked creatures, so you can just keep your marks. Oh, we don't even need to put them out then. No, not unless they affect marks somehow. Got it. Okay, so, so we don't need to worry about these. Technically, we have them, but yeah, yeah, and we're not going to go anywhere. Um, well. In this battle, I get what you're in saying. This battle, never, yeah, never, yeah. Would, never, we would never have them. They would take off. If, if, if when other we start monsters come up in the next room yep. that have special abilities with Mark, we'll use them. Correct. Got it. <clears throat> Highwaymen. Highwaymen. Okay, he's just going to use his two movement to come on up here as well. Um, I could do pistol shot over here and help you guys out with that. Um, Pretty please. Yeah. <laughs> so one to two, pistol shot over there. So accuracy of nine, crit two because of our torch. Crit. Crit, that's nine. Uh, it's not marked, so it takes half of that rounded up. Rounded up. So five damage. Five damage, yeah. And you both um, heal we, a stress. We both heal a stress, which... The Crusader definitely needed to do that. I'm going to reach over there and grab our, <coughs> grab our round tracker. It's in that little container. In here? Yep. I did not see it. Oh, alrighty. When I looked for the other things earlier, but I will check again. Alright, it is Mr. Ghoul's turn. And he wants to do... You were right. I know, I'm always right. <laughs> Except when you're wrong. He wants to attack the most crowded room, which happens to be two rooms. So it means he wants to go after the Crusader at a range of one, and he is going to howl. I'm just ready. I'm just telling you, you're welcome. Crit chance, one. Accuracy is ten, minus your dodge. So For the Crusader? For both. Right, it's so, the same roll. Oh, it's the same roll? Okay, so nines and eights. <laughs> or a critical. Or a critical. Okay. <laughs> critical doesn't that hurt too much. One damage each. Oh, that's not bad. You have some health over there. I do. And uh, our torch goes down by one as he blows out the torch. You each take two stress. Two stress? Two stress. Ow! And you take a stress for being critical for each of you. I already did that. Oh, you already did that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And... We lose one for, for crit. Oh! No. Oh! No, crit the other way. You take one more. Wow! Mm-hmm. Okay, well, that's not good. And you both get... Somehow, some way, he howled at you, and you both get a disease. He's got that stink breath. A creeping cough. That's why! <laughs> <laughs> He's got Just croup. Pu pu croup, I mean. Yes. <laughs> Now every time. Oh you, my goodness! Every time I roll that, the little yeah, bone you're pile bleed for four turns. Gee right. whiz! He did his worst. All right, bone defender. Wow. All right. Bone he defender is, he has is got to die. going to do an axe blade against the closest. Um, he's going to walk one forward, come visit you guys, and he's going to smash his axe into the crusader. Critical chance of one, accuracy of seven now. So against the Crusader. Yep. 
three. Okay. That's four damage. Oh, Straight. Yeah. Give me a fiver. You talk to yourself all the time? I do. All right. And the bone courtier wants to go next. You're just trying to make this go fast, ain't you? <laughs> you shuffled. <laughs> well, maybe I shuffled. No, you I shuffled, shuffled that after day. you shuffled. Um, okay. So he wants to do a one. He wants to do a tempting goblet against the most stressed. Tempting goblet? Mm-hmm. And so he's going to move forward here. And he's going to ask the crusader if he'd like a drink. He's got two range? Yep. Oh my goodness. Critical chance, zero. Accuracy of nine. Minus one is eight, so yeah, he got it. So three damage. Yeah, I'll drink that Kool-Aid. And one stress. Three damage. <laughs> I, I tell you what, I'm taking the word tank to heart here. I'm just saying. Because I just got attacked by every single one of us. Hey, you're the tank. I know. What you're supposed to do. I know, Cletus. All right. I'll run over there eventually and heal you. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I got my brand brand new fangled. Would have been nice if I could her up. I think she points. might get some more speed. And there you go. You oh, I take more stress? You take a stress from that. <sighs> You're now selfish, sir. That's because I'm always up here in front. Nobody ever so, takes any damage. Every time I'm always turn. the one doing it, you people. Every time it's your turn, you roll a one to four on a ten-sided dice. You consume <laughs> one of our provisions. <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to stress eat. That's what I'm going to do. All right, Grave Robber's turn. <laughs> she is going to... Well, crud. That's what I think. How much hit points does this little dude have? Seven? Man, it'd be nice to take him out quick, but do it. Um, do what must do be it. done. All right, she's gonna poison dart him. Yes. Critical chance two, accuracy nine. Got him. So that's a hit. Two damage and a blight for three turns. Double blight for three turns. Ooh. He has no blight resistance, right? No. Nope. Just bleed resistance. Okay. And for my second one, I'm going to throw a dagger at him. And that was a zero. That was That'd be a miss. Zero Snap. below one. All we're, right. We're not doing well. <laughs> we are not doing well. Uh -huh. All right, Vestal's turn. You don't need to heal us, really. Vessel's going to step forward one, and she's going to, she's going to dazzling light this gentleman here. <laughs> Sparkle fingers to the rescue, Sparkle baby. fingers, critical two, accuracy eight. And yes! uh, critical. Critical sparkle fingers is even down. better. Critical sparkle fingers is four damage. Oh. But that so, stuns him, though, too, doesn't it? He is stunned. He's also going to die when it's his turn. <laughs> no. He's stunned, and our light level goes up one. Okay. I'll take a stress. Oh, nice. Why do y'all keep turning the lights up? <laughs> That's not good. I'm going to eat some. i got to eat Snickers. We get three stressful darknesses, and you don't like light. Ugh. All right. We are on round two. Mm -mm -mm. That was a... That was a punishing first round. That was a very punishing first round. For, for my peeps over here. Oh, it really sucks to get two diseases right off the bat. Oh, and an affliction. And that's just going to keep coming because he's going to keep coming after me. Yep. Mm-mm-mm. Well, unless he goes after furthest, he would have to roll that middle dice. Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. Round two. Round two, fight. Fight. No! <laughs> you go with somebody else. Ten. Guess what he wants to do? He wants to howl again against you two. <sighs> Critical chance one, accuracy is ten minus whatever you've got. Okay. <sighs> it hits both hit of us. Both. Yep. Because so, it's eight for the highwayman and nine for the crusader. Yep. So our torch is going to go down one again. That's right. Oh. Every, you guys are both going to get two stress. Oh my gosh. And you're going to get a new disease. But 
Yeah, you didn't like that one. He finished. Oh, it cough. doesn't get added too. No, you did not. You only have one. I'm not coughing covered. anymore. Okay, so the highwayman is now bulimic. It went from a creeping cough to hemophilia. And now he's a hemophiliac. <laughs> Interesting. All right. So every time I get bleed, I get an additional bleed for two rounds, and I uh, take, wound take two wounds per hero level. Yeah. Wow. Four damage. Okay. That was his turn. <laughs> every time I eat. Every time you eat, I you get, get stressed. No, you, not only that. Every time you eat, you have to eat again and get stressed. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh dear. All right, Crusader's up. All right, Crusader. I got to roll for my selfishness. One to four. Here nope. All right. I'm I'm not I'm not hurting that bad right now. Okay, so time to uh, smash. Open up a can. Hope so smash. we'll start with uh, Smite one, uh, and it's plus one versus Unholy. Nice. So uh, accuracy nine, uh, crit zero. So that's a regular hit. That's seven damage. Split in half. So four. Yep. How much more does he have left? Six. All. Yeah. All of it. All of six. it. Yeah, he's got six left. Six left. Well, it was seven plus one, right? Yeah. So eight cut in half. It's four. four. Oh, that's right. Three and a half. Yeah. It rounds up anyway, so it doesn't yeah. really matter. So then we'll do a stunning blow. And he can be stunned. So. All right. Accuracy nine. Nine. No, no dodge. No dodge, so it's all good. Four, and he gets uh, stunned for one turn. Four more damage? Yeah. Well, two, if it's halved. Oh, two more damage. Yeah. Okay. Six, and he is stunned. Okay. And that's that. All right. Highwayman's turn. Highwayman. Highwayman... I'm wondering if I should. I'm gonna do. So let me ask you a question. Whenever I do grape shot blasts, Maybe zero to I have one. one of those two of those. Zero to one. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, two for me each, right? Well, one, no, uh, no. Yeah, two for me each now. Yeah. So that actually gives me a plus one crit. Yeah. So, okay. So if I do Grape Shot Blast, I still have to pick a regent. I can't oh, hit room. both of these That's guys, right. right? One room. Like, I couldn't stand over here and say, no. hey, I'm going to shoot both of you. No. Nope. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay, so I won't do that. I, what I will do, though, however, I'll do Open Vein on this guy. He's immune to bleed. Yeah, I know, but is this guy immune to bleed? Um, no. It's not. Okay. Well, I'm still going to do it because we want to try to knock out at least one of these yeah. dudes. Yep. He's got four health left. So, this will be five. Well, we'll see. So, crit chance two. Yes. Crit chance, crit chance two, accuracy ten. Got it. So, five uh, rounds. So that's three damage. Three damage. And... How much does he have left? One now? One hit point. So, yeah. We're just going to do a uh, Grape Shot Blast on him. And... Accuracy 8. Accuracy 8. Are you kidding me? <laughs> He's too close. Uh, you can't shoot him that close. I tried. He almost hit the Crusader. Yeah, he's got armor. It just bounced off. Okay. And he is stunned. So his stun goes away. That's it. Grave Robber's turn. So at the end of this guy's turn, if I remember correctly, he's at six. So he's going to die as soon as it's his turn. So the Grave Robber is going to... Oh, what's my best choice here? None of one of them are blighted. Maybe I'm going to do this. I'm going to move up here, and I will do a Poison Dart against this guy. So the blight, um, blight and Bleed effects aren't affected by armor. So mm -hmm. I'll get some stack and Blight on him, cool. hopefully. Good idea. So Good idea. Take that off. Crit chance is 3, accuracy is 10. 7. So that's it. That's only one damage in the bright scheme of things. 
but right. it's going to turn on, turn Three into a, what, six more? Six more, hopefully. Yeah, over time. That's seven damage altogether. Not bad. Mm -hmm. Not bad at all. Okay. All right, so the Vestal's turn. I wish I had better range on my heels. They don't, um, and I can only have two characters. Oh wait, not Vestal's turn. Hang on, gotta draw first. So mm. It's his turn, so he is out. He's dead. <coughs> Thank you. Okay, so he's this out. This is still nasty, but I'm like, okay, this is doable. This is doable. Vestal's turn. Because he's about to die. This guy's going to take a while yeah. longer, but... Is he going to... Yeah, he's about to die. It's just, I was hoping I could shoot two and just kind of finish that guy off. But I'm going to go here. I still don't need to heal exactly. Um, can I stun? Um, no, the ghoul's immune to stun. So... Get rid of one of those, and I'm going to just Dazzling Lights him anyway, so I can raise our torch. Which isn't much, but it's something. So that is a crit for four damage or two damage. So he's now at eight. Mm -hmm. And our light is going to go up one. Dude, you're killing me over here, literally. Well, it's your fault for being... <laughs> Wrong in the head. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Now we'll Eight see goes. how you feel when I'm gone, and you don't have to be taking all that damage. You ain't going anywhere. <laughs> I come and heal you eventually. I told you I would. That was round two. That was round two. So now we're already in round three. Yeah. Oh snap! We're not gonna make it. We are. I don't know, man. Hey, Robert's gonna unleash some stuff. <laughs> She dug too deep. You may not want to <laughs> smell that poison. Okay, round three. It's his <sighs> turn. So he's going to take two. <clears throat> so that's going to put him at ten damage. Okay. Hmm. And he is going to do a three. He's actually going to want to do a rend this time against the closest, which is you two gentlemen, except for... He has no range, and your space is full. He's stuck. So he can't come on in here, huh? Nope, that's it. Too bad, so sad. Crusader's turn. All right. Crusader is going to... Roll his consume one provision dice? Yes. Don't be selfish. Nope, nope. Nice. there's a ten. He's not selfish, man. He's got resolve, this guy. Yes, he does. He's, his, he's, uh... His stomach is growling, and he's still hanging in. Not gonna do it. All right, so I will roll... Well... Man. Stunning blow. Yeah. Stunning blow. Accuracy 9. Uh, crit 2, so... Plus your crit there. Yeah. Give me a token. That put you at crit three? No, no, it's crit oh, two because good. it's uh it's a zero, one, gotcha. one two with Got the it. thing, so it's it's only a two. But that's two damage, so I think he's toast. And to him finally. And with that those couple of stuns kinda helped. He's going to and zealously stuff. accuse the ghoul. Oh. <laughs> Why don't he heal himself? No, I'm just kidding. Get him. Let's accuse him. That's Seven. a hit. It's accuracy nine, crit two. So that's uh, three damage. All right, 13 is halfway. That's it. All right. D&D, &D, he'd almost be bloodied. Highwayman's turn. No, we're just going to go down the line because he's the only one left. Highwayman. Don't eat food. All right, so first things first. Um... Hmm. Um, I think I'm going to uh, do a duelist advance. 
Um, that will be an accuracy of 9, crit 3. Got it. Nine. So that's 4 damage, only 2 though. But he does pull 1. So we need to switch. Crap. And the Crusader. And then he also gets a buff, and then he gets a, I don't know what that symbol, I can't remember what that symbol does. What's that? Oh, a repost. Yeah, a repost. He gets two reposts, and then he also gets a buff. And a buff. For how many turns? Um, just one, looks like, right? Um, now, the buff that he used on that attack mm -hmm. is, is, is still active. Round, yeah. Still active, yeah. yeah. Okay. So now we are we're going to try to open the vein because this guy is not immune to bleed. He is not. So it's a six. It was an accuracy nine. I'm sorry, accuracy ten, crit three. Mm hmm. Um, so, no, crit two. So, that is a hit, so it's three damage, and then, uh, two level two bleeds. You have the bleeds. And I do. Uh, nice. So now he's bleeding so... and poisoned. Okay. There you go. So, on to... Hmm, I think I should run and get a treasure. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm <laughs> thinking about it. You will hear it from the highwayman oh. and the crusader afterwards. I'll just be whining the whole time. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, well, I'm going to throw another poison dart then. As a nine. Luckily that's still a hit for two damage or one damage. That puts him at 19. And another Blight for two turns, or for three turns. So he's going to take it. six at the start of his turn. Oh, he needs one more, doesn't it? Yep. And I'm go. although we don't want him to die too quick, I'd like to be able to heal something. Um, and then I'm going to throw a dagger at him. Why not? Hoping I was going to get a crit there, but no. So I'm going to do four damage, or two damage for half... So that puts him at 21. So he's going to die at the start of his next turn. Mm -hmm. And that's her turn. Okay. So the Vestal now is going to just step forward. Should I step forward and steal a chest or should I step forward and heal? I better heal this guy. He's pretty hurt, right? 11? Oh, well, it's 11 he's out of 24. He's half. That's I mean, right. he, it's, it's stress that he's that's really hurting him. I can't heal his stress. Yeah, nothing we can do about that, really. Okay, so I'll heal his health for, instead of being greedy, I'll go do that. Um, accuracy 14, crit chance, 5. Not to the first. Ooh, crit. That's a crit. So his stress goes down, and you heal for 7. The Crusader? Yep. All right, give me 3 back. Go ahead. Oh, my bad. Keep forgetting you did that. It's all right. Okay. That's our turn. We are in fourth round. Remember, if you don't defeat him in four rounds, you have to uh, leave the room and try again. Oh, <laughs> it would basically respawn everything. Yep. Wow. A full new encounter with all the... Oh, we're going to knock him out of the park. at things that happen here. I mean, we got to set up where he's going to die. He yeah. going to die. Well, go steal a chest or something or heal yourself. Okay, Crusaders first. Or no, Highwaymen's first. Excuse me. Highwaymen's first. All right, so... What speed does he got? He's got a speed of two. So I'll go down here and then take a look at this chest, which is a roll of a provision die. Nice bandages. Bandages. Man, I don't have any of those. And just note, we have 12 dice there. Um, there's a max of 16 provisions. So. Got it. All right. Um, I think that's it for me, though. 
Uh, that would have taken away one of these and one of these, though. Yeah. Okay. Crusader's turn. Roll for your selfishness. <laughs> Sounds so bad. <laughs> Six. Oh, so far, you're still doing not good, selfish. Though. We like that guy. Not really. We don't like him, but we're glad he's not seven, eating our stuff. program's working, He's baby. hiding shovels in the yeah. corners of the rooms. Okay. So it's his turn. Um... We don't, do we want to kill him, or do you want to get more... Um, yeah, I mean, when he pulls, he's done, so you can't run that far. I can just go one. So you could heal yourself and... Yeah. Come closer. <laughs> Alright, so battle heal. Crit accuracy 14, crit... And then die. Three. So no. Okay. Uh, but I get, th I get to heal three. Oh wait, who can I heal? I can heal not just myself. I can heal zero to one, so oh, you can. I would not heal myself. I would heal. I didn't know he had a ranged heal. Yeah, zero to one. Nice. So two back. That's awesome. Now I don't have to do all the healing. But I would have had to do it. I would have had to move here because it's zero to one. So. Okay. All right. Well, Grave Robber gets to go next, so she's gonna <laughs> run up here and ooh, roll for some money. 12. 12 bucks. 12 bucks. We'll take it. Oh, and we get our 10 from entering the dungeon. Yeah. So here, we're going to put that over in our in our hamlet. In our stash. Yep. Got it. Okay. So let's see. Look at that. Everybody. Shuffle that. Okay. So I can then heal. I can't heal you both. You're in different rooms. I'll heal the highwaymen. Okay. With um, Divine Comfort, which means she gets to heal herself, too. Critical chance is four. Ooh, a crit. got so it. he loses one stress. That's good. And he heals for three, and she heals for two. Mm. Right on. Cool beans. Guess who goes next? <laughs> he dies. He dies. If he dies, he dies. Okay. Are we going to reorder those? Yeah. Going back into exploration phase? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. You get these bleeds. That little dude was nasty. He was nasty. Okay. <clears throat> he wasn't that little either. No, he was not. <laughs> All right. Okay. Can we, can we, can right. we do the camp? So that's our first one. We sure can. We get our first one for an experience point later. Would you put that chest over there, please? Yep. All right. We can do the camp. Do we need the camp already? This dude is hurting with stress, man. He's like fuming. Well, our camp is. He's hungry and he's been fighting it. All right. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Let's do it. Bunch of, bunch of stress relief. We're just gonna camp right off the bat. Go for it. All right. You so can only go three, so. One, two, three. That's it. I have to stay in the red. Yep. Until um, you go back to town. How many does he have? That's nine we have left now? Yep. Can I do three on him as well? Sure. One, two, three. If I do three on this, we still have three left. Yep. So. Um, maybe heal? Go ahead. One, two, three. Yep. We'll do one more stress on him and then heal him too. Sure. Right on. That's called micromanagement, folks. <laughs> <laughs> we have no camp now. But anyways, all nah, right. we don't need no more camp now. Okay, so assuming last since we words. got this nice little roll here, we're going to back up, which we all take one stress to backtrack. Because <sighs> we like to. And now we roll. And now we're moving forward again. We're going this way. Going towards the grave robber. I would win. Oh, stressful darkness. Ooh, Crusader. Traps. traps. Okay. So right. traps now do two damage on a normal hit. Nah. And six damage nah. on a crit. Nah. Nah what? Oh. I'm using a shovel. What? Nah. Chicken. Nah, that's not a chicken. <laughs> stressful stressful darkness. darkness. We better get rid of one of those. Yes. Huh? Okay. All right. Two traps. 
We are digging ourselves out of a pit. Okay. okay. Well, we used up some stuff, but we're good. We're on to our next room. We are going to randomly select map four. Be random. Oh man, this little ditch. Well, this that doesn't happen though, does it? Um, because we're not actually using the card that gives the... Yeah, I would uh, assume you're supposed to set those to the side. That's a good question though, because I mean it is a spike pit. But this one isn't a spike pit, right? It's just no, the layout. It's an objective room. It's an objective room, it's not the actual spiked pit, right? I won't use them during other encounters. I mean says you won't use them during other encounters, so I guess I would have to tend to agree. Yeah. Yeah. Let's populate. Ooh, look at this. Uh-oh. Uh-huh. A gargoyle. Gargoyle. Oh, man. I think he's in the, in the uh, front. I think he's in the Crimson Court box. And I don't think you have those over there. Except he's a normal baddie. I didn't, I didn't know that though, man, when I was going through them. Oh, happy that. It looked like he was going to be one of those people that were on the Crimson Cord, but. Yes. He goes uh, to the front, uh, uh. wherever that may be. He goes to the front. Right. Back to the front. Hey, we got a brigand, brigand cutthroat. We have a bone arbalist. We've seen those before. B brigand cutthroat. Hmm. And we have another bone arbalist. Arbalist. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. And we will put a little armor on that dude so we can tell who it is. Mm-hmm. Even though he doesn't have He doesn't armor. have armor. No. Okay. So then we need we to don't have cool colored rings yet. Right here. Not too. here. And Alright. Pay attention. Pay attention. Alright, here we go. You know, I would have to imagine, kind of imagine that we need to use that for this map. Don't you? I don't know. It kind of makes the map a little bit more sticky, right? Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Basically, spike pits, if you end your turn here, you're going to take damage. You're going to take damage. So... I'd say we use them. Unless you think otherwise. Um, I mean, if you want to make off. things harder, I guess so. Circle of power, enemies landing here. Heal for four. Mm -hmm. And if you're pulled or pushed into spike pits, you take three damage. And if you end your turn there, oh, and suffer one bleed for three turns. And if you end your turn there, you also get a bleed. So we don't want to end our turns there. He has armor. Uh, he'll and come out he's of there. stuck there. Oh, uh, you think he'll come out, huh? Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. Okay, man. All right. We want to make it harder, not easier. Okay. So I no, don't know if I agree with that sentiment. No guts, no glory. No. All right. <laughs> okay. So does this mean that it's second level? This little second... He's actually, yep, that's a higher space. So he can't come out of there. No. So, so when you're in a higher space, which is cool... Um, you get a plus one range to all of your abilities. Uh huh. And yeah, you get a plus one range. But how? So his it steps down to here. It steps down to here. There's, Got there's it. like a set of stairs here. Yep, yep, yep. Gotcha. Okay. So we can't go up here. We have to go. We up have this to go way. up around. Yep. Yeah. Okay, Crusaders first. Cruz. <laughs> um. Hmm. He does not have any oh, anything for reach. that range, huh? Nothing at that range. So what I'm going and he also can't walk but one. Yeah. So I'm gonna take a minus one movement. Mm -hmm. So this can flip back around and give me plus one movement next turn, and I'm just gonna heal myself. Right on. 
So battle heal, accuracy 14. Okay. That's actually a crit. But I don't need it because he only had two hit points. And you go drop your stress, and so does the highwayman. Right on. I'm not so bad. Airman's oh, I didn't roll for this. Sorry. I was hoping. Ten. So far, he's doing good. Still good. No, we're good. We're good. All right, highwayman's turn. Highwayman. All right, he can move too. So. What I think I will do, um, I only have a pistol shot that can go two though. Oh. And my duelist advance is only a pull one, so I'd only be able to go one, and I don't want to do that. Is it pull you one or pull him one? Oh, that'd be cool if it pulled him one. No, that. no, he's not Scorpion. <laughs> he's just the highwayman. Somebody has a pull skill. So, well, the bounty hunter can pull people. So, what I think I will do. He's cooler than the highwayman. I'll go one, two, like this, for my movement. And then I will grape shot blast in here. Nice. So, that's going to be accuracy eight, crit. One because of our torch level. Yeah, that's a miss. That's a miss. Okay. Argyle dropped his wings, blocked it all. <laughs> Just closed it up. All Stone right. wings. Grave robbers next. Um. What is he? He's immune to bleed. He's not immune to blight. Um, actually, which one of those guys is meaner? The Bone Arbalist is almost just as mean. We did forget our mark of three for each of us. We're going to need oh, that. Oh, we need that to this time? Yep. Okay. Um, all right. So. Okay. All right. Well. The Gargoyle has armor, Both too. of my guys would have. They only have two now. Yes. Because they've already done That's their correct. turns. So. I'll take some oh. threes there. Three. Right on. I don't need to put it right on her forehead though, that's a bad idea. And then whose turn is it? It is the Grave Robber's turn. So just got it. There you go. Perfect. Okay. I'm tempted to just try to kill the bone arbalist. Since it doesn't have armor. Um, their damage is very comparable. That's a push. I'm gonna go try for to, it. I'm gonna shoot the bone arbalist. Okay. I'm gonna throw a. Oh, I should do flashing daggers, but they're too far away. I'm gonna throw a poison dart at him. Okay. Old faithful. Whoa. Um, bone arbalist has one dodge. So that's a miss. Dang it! Um, try again. Yes. Try again. Do it the same one. That's a five. So that's a hit. Two damage. I'd much rather done that and the other, but that's all right. Mm -hmm. A stack of three blight. Not bad, not bad. Okay. That's her turn. Oh, look, Vesto goes next. Guess we know who's finishing out the round. Jeez Louise. Nobody needs health? No, I'm good on health. And the Vestal's speed is only one, and she doesn't have anything help with speed so I can't dazzling light you are really man you can have one of those marks back well you can move too you can move you can just move for both of your turns right yeah I can just kind of puts her in the forefront and what do we have crowded areas no, I can't do that. Mm -mm. That's all I can do mm -hmm. is go there. Uh, well, that, okay. Alright, who decided to use those pit traps? Anyways. Hmm. I, <laughs> <laughs> I wonder. Okay. Alright, so I got go. four monsters. Man, 
Gargoyle. They really shuffled that straight. Okay, Gargoyle's turn. He wants to do a nine. He wants to do a lash of the tail against the closest, which would be him. Mm -hmm. um, accuracy is nine, minus two, so accuracy is seven, crit chance two. Seven. So three damage. Two stuns. The stun means you lose your first action each turn. Yeah. Um, ooh, he's marked. Does that yeah, matter? he doesn't have. Doesn't matter okay. for him. Um, <coughs> and pushed one space. So obviously, you don't want to push into a spike trap. So, yep. Okay. All right. For the cutthroat, he's in defensive position. He wants to do a three. He wants to do a uppercut slice against the closest. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So that means against this guy. Mm. But he only has one speed. And that's it. Okay. So, Bone Arbalus is next. He's going to take two more damage. One, two. That puts him to four. He's got seven left. And he wants to, can't see it, he wants to do quarrel against the marked character that is the furthest away from him. So we're all marked, two, two, we're all two, so he wants to do it against the crusader. Okay. Um, accuracy nine, or eight, crit chance two. Four. Okay. That's a hit. Four, since you're marked, six damage. Oh! As you take a shot to the face, not to, maybe not the face, shoulder. That might appeal a lot more than six damage. Yes. All right, and the second bone arbalist is in the back spot. He's way up here. He wants to do the same thing against the furthest away that's marked, which would be her. So that means he's going to move two spaces, and his range is going to be too far away. He needs a range that's of two. One, so. two. Yep. So that's all he does. already. And any creature in the circle of power heals up four health. <laughs> I thought you said he was going to go somewhere. Well, we didn't hit him. We surrounded so. him. <laughs> <laughs> well, we didn't even hurt him. The other guy, the bone arm, was healed yeah. four health. We need to get him out of there. Bone arm is we like, to chase ooh, us. I like it here. Yeah. All right. Bad idea. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. I think you just broke the game, dude. I might have broke the game. Or just played by the rules for once. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't say that we use that. Well, well I think it does. We need to figure that out. I've never seen that encounter before, or that uh, quest before, but... Um, okay, so he wants a lash... No, he wants to... Yes, he does. He wants a lash of the tail against. Gets the closest, um, which is now... The Vestal. Okay. So crit chance two, accuracy nine. <laughs> there it is. Three damage. Hmm. She's a five. Stun for two. And push one. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, Crusader. You gotta move faster this time. All right, I'm gonna use this speed stone oh, you can't for move faster. two, and um, we'll move one, two up here. Can you use Zealous Accuse in the same spot? No, you can't. Uh... Mm -mm. So I could go one, two over here, though. And then do zealous accusation in here. Mm -hmm. Well, we gotta kill those guys this round. Yeah, tell me about it. Um, so, 
Accuracy 9, crit 1. It's a hit. So hit five. them both? Yeah. For how much? Uh, hit them both for 5 damage, so 3 five. on the gargoyle and 5 on the other guy. Nice. 3 is good, he's only got 4 left. No. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yep. Oh, you're right, you're right. Okay. Highwayman? Highwayman. Um... Uh, zero, one, zero, one, one to two, pistol shot. Hmm. I give up a couple of your marks and tokens. Yes. You only get one so action. I only get one action. Um, uh, both of these are over there. This is over here. Mm. Um, three more damage doesn't kill him. No. That's all I've got, though. Um, that's all I can do. He's already gone this turn, though. Uh huh. So we don't have to worry about. We just have to heal about. Can you kill him? Bone arbalist. How he much do we have? Six health left? left. Six health. Really, you need to do four damage for him to blight out. Okay, I can do that. I can do that with Duelist Advance, and it'll actually let me move here and still do Pistol Shot over. No, I only have one. You only have one action. I only have one action. So I'll do Duelist Advance, and that'll move me over here. Um, so I'll do that. Okay. Duelist Advance, Accuracy 9, Crit 2. It's a dodge of 1, so. So he, it's a hit. So that's 4 damage. Okay. That puts him at 9. He's gonna go on his turn. And that pulls me over one. I do it all my ones. I need a one from you, please. What? Health. Um gives me two repost. Um a buff and pulls me one. Okay. Stun left, huh? All right, the cutthroat. That, that he that, wants to do an up oh, cut slice against the closest. Yeah, so he's gonna walk into here and uh, attack you. Accuracy Crusader. eight, critical chance two, so accuracy seven. That's a nine. He misses. It's a miss. Okay. Okay, he's gonna not make it. Is that the guy in the middle? That is the guy in the middle. Okay. We got. We got to kill him. Mm-hmm. Otherwise, he's gonna go back to full health. Otherwise, he's gonna be back to full health. Okay. All right, grave robbers up next. And I'm gonna lose one of my marks. I'm actually here. Just give me that. I'm gonna put it right here. So I'm gonna have to get it back next yeah, combat yeah, yeah. encounter. Um, all right. So we need to kill him. So I'm gonna use poison dart, dart on him first. Poison dart. Yes. Ooh, for a crit. So this will go down one. She's all by herself. That's gonna do four damage. Gonna do two damage. So he's at five. Plus the blight. Three rounds, which isn't hopefully going to matter. No, he's dead. And then I'm going to throw a dagger at him as well. Um, accuracy seven, crit chance three. Okay, um. that's a hit. No more Mr. Gargoyle. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. Our second level two monster in the drink. <laughs> Okay, that leaves us Bone Arbalist. He's now in defense position. He's going to want to do a bayonet jab against the closest. So that would be Highwayman, Accuracy 8, Crypt Chance 1. Got it. So three damage. 
and he pushes himself one space. Three damage. So give me a five. And pushes him one space. To the vestal. Oh, pushes him one space to mm -hmm. the vestal. Got it. Okay. So Yeah, pushes himself one space. Okay. The vestal, right? We don't want him in the middle or do, do we any, just do want any him other to go? does it do any other damage against Mark? No. Okay. Nope. Or should we just have him go to the middle? So we can all reach him. He's gonna oh he doesn't have any he doesn't damage have any, to heal. Yeah, yeah sure. Might as well. Alright, so then Vesta only gets one action. So she's gonna heal the highwayman. Uh, with divine comfort so she can heal herself too. Crit chance four. Oh, kill that dude. Um, you get two heals and she gets two heals. Okay, that's cool. it. Cool. One, two. We are on round three. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, eight and eleven. So we got to do nineteen hit points between this round and next. Yeah. yeah. That's not too yeah, bad. Neither of them have. Neither of them have armor, so that should be doable. As long as we don't miss. Way to jinx us already. Hey, I'm just saying. Okay, Highwayman is first. Highwayman is in the lead. Alright, he'll do a duelist advance. Can he do that from the front? He cannot. He cannot. Pooper duper. No more running forward. So... I'll just come on in here and open the vein. Alright. That'll give him plus two bleed, too. He's immune to bleed. Oh, that's right. He's a bone arbalist. Mm-hmm. Doo-doo. All right, anyway. Accuracy 10. That's nice. a crit that's anyway. A crit. So that's nine damage. No armor? Wow. No armor. That's a hit. Five. Wow. Oh, you know what? Stop. What? Stop, stop, stop. What'd I do? I can't do any damage. I got this stun. Oh. I can only move. Get rid of one of each of those. Yeah. Man. Why you get my hopes up? That sucks, doesn't it? We could shoot somebody then. Just stay back here and shoot. No. I'm I'm in aggressive stance. Mm. Open veins the only thing I can do in aggressive stance. Oh. So screwed the pooch. So did you just gonna move in the middle? <sighs> yeah. You could just run back there to the chest. Um, I'll do that. Coward. So that gives me plus one. No, I'm. I'm yeah, yeah. Sniper. Oh, sniper. Yeah, coward. Don't call me a coward. <laughs> I was talking to him, not you. I'm the sniper. I'm running up to the bell tower, man. Come on. You know what happens to the sniper in the bell tower, right? It's yeah, a whole does. knife scene. He always does. Uh, okay. He's never. Long for this world. Mm -hmm. Riggin' Cutthroat. He wants to do something nasty. Look at what I drew. Five. He wants to do a slice and dice against the most crowded room. Hmm. There are no. You are the most crowded room. He wants to move one space. Move him up. Move him down. We do have a pit. No, we have to move him up. That's rude. <laughs> And he does an extra damage against somebody that's marked. Snap. So, accuracy 9, crit chance 2, so accuracy 8. And he almost got worse that time. Mm. Six, damage. Six damage. Six damage. Six damage. Goodness gracious. Wait, slice and dice. Four damage. Sorry. Looked at the wrong one. All right, so uh, I have twelve. 10. So yeah, and you get debuff for two turns. All right, debuff for two turns. That's nastiness. Okay. Okay. All right, Crusader's up. All right, he's. All right, which one is this? The uh, Bone Arbalist has more hit points. Mm-hmm. 
Cutthroat's harder to hit and does more damage pretty much, right? Yeah, I think so. So we will He has Dude. 8 damage. We'll move in and maybe I'll get a crit. We'll move in and maybe I'll get a crit. Or you could or you could attack him at distance and I'll uh, pick him in the face later. Fine. I'll let you? you I'll let you have all the glory. I'll just zeal I'll just yell at him. Okay. I'll zealously accuse him. I could kill him with this though. I'm just saying. I yep. my 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 yep. my words fall deeply, but not that deeply today. Not that deeply. Five damage. Couple of counters there. Yep. Five damage. Five damage. It's not bad. Alright. And for your second action. I will battle heal. That's accuracy fourteen, so that made it, so I heal three. And for your selfish. Oh yeah. Should have rolled that first. There it is. I eat. You drink an antidote. Now do I still get the benefit of it? Nope. You just waste it. Really? Because it I says consume, consume one. one. Sure. So what I don't know what the benefit of Well consuming one would be using it up. I don't know. Like you can get a food. You that'll, don't need a bandage. That'll heal me though, right? That'll heal you one. Yeah. I'm selfish. Alright, eat some food. I did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Told you, man. It's stress eating. Mm -hmm. Alright, Grey Robber's next. That's you. That is me. So, I have movement of three. I'm gonna move up here and I'm gonna pick this dude in the face. Yeah! Pickaxe to the face! Pickaxe in the face. And it ignores armor too. Ooh! I haven't had a chance for that. Got him. Got him. You're out of there. Okay. That leaves us with. Bone arm to list. All right, Vesta goes Vestal. next. Let's turn on my two marks, by the way. All right, so Vestal's turn. He's got five health. She has three. She has one stun, though. So she's only going to get one action. So I think she's just going to heal again. Crit chance four. Ooh, that is a crit. Nailed it. This drops down. You get three health, and I get two health. Not much of a crit for a level one skill, but that's pretty good. Still, pretty good uh, if I don't say so myself. All right, and the last guy, Bone Arbalus, he now wants to do a bayonet jab against the closest. Yep. Bring it, boy. Oh, well, he's moving in with you. And uh, accuracy of seven, modified crit chance one. Three. Okay, three damage. And he's gonna push himself one space. So, you can't, well, you push him up here so that we don't put him back in there. Why not? I don't know, well. How well we he, he won't he's be able not, to reach. He doesn't so have any damage. To, I know, yeah. And we're in round four, so mm -hmm. push him back there so we can all try to hit him. Yeah. Cause if we don't get him this time, we get to start over. Oh, we're gonna get him this time. Alright. The uh highwayman's got something for him. What's he gonna do? Pick up a chest and throw it at him? Well, here's the thing. I've got three attacks. Yeah, except we're in the wrong stance. Uh, then y'all need to do something about it. <laughs> oh, I gotta move you, huh? <laughs> Man. No, I can... Yeah. Alright, it's his turn. He is gonna want to... You know, he's gonna want to do a bayonet jab against the closest. 
He's coming back. Hmm. That yeah, could be bad. Nope. All right. Accuracy seven. Right. But I have three more nine. Yeah. Accuracy is eight. Minus oh, one and seven. Um, three damage, and he's gonna push himself. One space. Three damage. Yeah, so that's twelve. All right. Keep so it's hard. We'll roll down through the group. Highwayman's first. You are first there, sir, that's clear in the back. I can't do nothing, because I'm in the wrong stinking spot. Mm -hmm. You lose your repost, and... Oh, no, wait, I'm not stunned this turn, though. You're not. You get two okay. actions. Okay, so I'm, I'm good. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Because I'll use my first action to... I think you should pick up a chest. I'm going to knock this dude out. <sighs> Well, all right. should, should we get get, uh, do, do we need to fill? We need to get the chest? Maybe. Nah, that's all good. Money. I'm money hungry. Man, you... <laughs> we are not here to make money. We all are here right. to shoot at the... clear the land of the darkness. Shoot the, shoot the poor little skeleton then. I'm gonna. All I'm right. gonna shoot the poor little skeleton. Because I'm gonna <laughs> use my first action and I'm gonna come back. One spot. Tell you to start running forward again. And the pistol shot gives me plus one damage up. I mean, plus one. Uh, yeah, plus one range. Range, so one, two, three. Yep. And. Um, so let's see. You got, oh, pistol shot. Uh, accuracy nine, crit two. Nope. Missed. That's a miss. Is it a miss? Yep. Oh, he's got one, one dodge. He? Fart knocker. Man, I'm gonna watch that chest just sit there for nothing. No, I'm just kidding. All I right. know. <laughs> Crusader's turn. We were actually like. <laughs> You're set up on top up of on the chest? It, yeah, yeah. yeah. Propped up on top of it. Didn't help. Gunpowder but fell in the lock it and did. seized it. Mm hmm. Okay. Alright, Crusader's next. Crusader. Okay. Um, so I'll move in here because you can come in even yep. if need be. So I'm gonna come in. Oh, come on in and do a uh, stunning blow so that even if he does activate, should I do that or should I do smite? Whatever does the most damage. Smite does the most damage. Yeah. Plus one versus unholy, so. Alright. Two. Crit one. Dang it. So. Eight damage? Uh, eight damage, that is correct. Okay. We'll take it. He's got three left. Mm hmm. You should be able to do something with your uh, sparkle fingers or dazzle. Should I go dazzle up here and get a chest <laughs> <laughs> I'll come in here and I will do a pick in the face. That's what I'm talking about. Accuracy eight. Pick in the face. Like like this. Whoops. What is wrong with you? <laughs> Man. Okay, well that was her turn. Come on, Dazzle Fingers. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Sparkle hands, let's go. Sparkle hands is a nine, the accuracy eight, critical chance of two. How much damage does it do? Enough, two. No, it needs three. <laughs> That's all I got. We got no extra damage. What about blight or something like that? What was my accuracy before? My accuracy was nine. That would have made it one more, but I still would have missed. I rolled a ten, right? Uh, I don't. I think so. Yeah. You got no blight. If I don't roll a crit, where do you fail this mission? Are you serious? <laughs> yes. If I don't roll a one or a two, we're out of here. Well, it's the highwayman's fault. He should have done something. Oh my goodness. That's the opposite. Opposite. <laughs> what in the world? All right. We fail this room, not the mission, right? We fail the room. So we, do we get automatically kicked out? Do we, we have to automatically take, do we have to take a stress for that? Uh, no. Nope. Because so we backtrack. We have to explore again. Okay. No. 
Uh, <laughs> take some chest. That was horrible. That was How's that even possible? Um, I wonder how that was possible. Mm. I still think that's got to be it. We'll see. I'll double check on it. I'm going to see. But that seems like it's with the... So when it says... With it being level two mm -hmm. monsters. Well, it's supposed to be tougher. Yeah. When it says set four and eight to the side, I'm thinking you're supposed to set those two aside and randomly pick one when you hit one of those rooms. Really? Yeah. I don't think it means the map. Got it. The encounter. I'll go with your deeper knowledge. Oh. Of the game. I don't like my knowledge but anymore. But that was that was rough. All right. Well, we did all that. that super for rough. Absolutely nothing. You could have at least got us one chest. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I had my eyes on the right prize, you man. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. <laughs> all right. So we're gonna go this way just to be. We're gonna come. So we were like, nah, we're not that way. Back. We're gonna go down. All right. Here we go. All right. We already scouted. Highwaymen. And that's the crusade. Oh, look Two at all those traps. traps. That's three traps. And hunger. hunger. Well, I can take that. All right. Mm. You're already at 12 health. I so am. you either got to take a roll against yourself or burn our last shovel. Um, I think I'm going to I'm gonna do the shovel. Because I'm at half health and I'll roll against myself on the on the highway. All right, there's our last shovel. Highwayman. Oh, that's a miss. Yes. All right. So then, grave robber. That is a critical for six damage. Owie. Mm -hmm. That was right. That was not ideal. Okay, and I will eat that food like there's no tomorrow. No, no, no. We got one help, XP. You know that, right? We do. You want to leave with one XP? Mm. It's mighty inviting. Because uh, those stupid spike pits come back in the healing room. Come back. Is that's going to make it hard. Our stress is good. Yeah, I know. Kinda. I just want you to turn the lights off, man. We are the ex <laughs> Every time I turn the lights on, I heal, though. I <laughs> Anyways, what did I do with those two cards now? There they are. Okay. Come on, we gotta get one more. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. What's your marks on? Mark three, everybody. Okay. The last monster each round tries to go to the middle. Remember, if he stays there at the end of the round, we take two stress oh, each. No. Oh no! Stupid. Poor. It's my fault. It's reaching over stuff. Poor young lady. Tongue gray robber. Darn it. I will is, fix is her. This, is this foretelling? Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's better not, not be. All right. Ah, uh, dude, I'm an idiot. She'll make it through the day. Yeah, she will. I predict she will come back stronger than ever. Got a madman. Clean up my mess over here. We have oh, ooh, your new best friend. No. A rattler. Oh, jeez. Mr. Rattler. No. Beast in the front. Where the front is. Big old snake. Twenty-two health mm -mm -mm. and fast. Oh, followed by a bone spearman. Now level two. Who decided to do this? You fight? did. I did. I have faith. <laughs> Bone spearman. There he is. All right. Oh, gee whiz. Don't draw. All right. Bone courtier. We have seen that young man before. Okay. 
We can't let them get to the middle. And then we're going to have to go back to the hamlet and lick some wounds. I would assume. Mm -mm -mm. All right, we all got our three marks. So the madman's going to be the one heading to the middle. Yes. Everybody else is going to come out fighting. Unless we kill him first and then the courtier will go. Yeah. Look at that snake, 22 health. No, that is not a token for a 22 health person. It is not. He looks, he is small and mean. Okay, Crusaders first. Crusader. You gonna go yell at people again? Um, you better believe it. All right. Cause that's all I can do. Accuracy nine. Okay. Got it. Go hit. So, um, five damage. Five. To him. Yeah. Right on. That's it. Oh. <laughs> I gotta consume another provision. You wanna drink one of these, please? Shh. And hell's your stress, but you don't need it. Sure. We don't really wanna lose our torches, do we? Nope. I guess if we're in the last room, it wouldn't matter. Um. All right, the Rattler's going to go first. He is in the attack position, aggressive position, and he wants to do a snake bite against the furthest away. He's going to go one, two, three, and accuracy is ten, crit chance two, so accuracy eight. Crit two. Five. So that's a hit for five damage. Cool. Oh, man. And two bleed for three turns. So because you have a resistance, it's two bleed for two turns. Two bleed for two turns. Yep. Wow. Yeah, that's, that's a wow. All right. Spearman is going to go next. He's going to enact his revenge. He wants to do a spear thrust against the closest. So he's going to step forward. Can he fit in that room with you? Yep. Okay. He's going to do a step forward. Accuracy is 8, so accuracy 7, crit 2. Alright, there you go. So that is... Oh, seriously? I had to read that twice. That's eight damage. Oh my god. <laughs> That's eight damage and he pushes you one space. Which is really gonna suck for the highwayman. Why? Because he just got pushed to the front. Oh snap. He doesn't want to be. I'll go there. Okay. These dudes are nasty. Bone Courtier wants to do a tempting goblet against the most stressed, which would be a highwayman. I just want to point out, mm -hmm. once again, your guys are getting beat up. One, two, three. <laughs> I see. Wait a second. What are you doing? So, He's not even there yet. What's his range? He's going to do a tempting goblet. So he needs to move forward. All right, fine. So then you take one stress. That's all. With the hit, you With mean? The high, yeah, highwayman. Highwayman. He's not the most stressed. He's actually the most stressed. He has oh. an affliction, but he has three stress. He has zero stress right now. But he's already so it's going. It's not oh. eleven. It doesn't count that way. Okay. All right. So he gets one stress. It basically starts it over, but you get this thing to got hang it. out with. Got it. Got it. Okay. Next on the list is the highwayman. Hmm. And he's back in front position. <sighs> so the only thing he can do is open vein. Um, and the spearman is immune to bleed, so mm -hmm. that doesn't really help. It hurt. To, wouldn't hurt to open vein on the rattler then, so he could tick down a little bit. But yeah. Is the rattler immune to bleed? No, 
The other two are, but we'll it is that. not. I'll move in one and, and attack the Rattler. So open vein is accuracy 10. Nine. Oh, what two. Misses. Oh, seriously? Yeah. All right, well you take two damage from your bleed. I do. And this mark. Okay. Well, the Mad Man's gonna go here and hang out. Okay, so it's Grave Robber's turn. Poor little Grave Robber. Uh, she shall return. She's gonna lose a mark. Yeah, well, she's gotta kill this guy somehow. Which is pretty much impossible from there. Impossible. Uh, what's the best she's got? She can run up. Yeah, because she can go here. She's going to run one, two, three. She doesn't have blight or bleed or nothing. So she's just going to do a pick to the face. Accuracy is nine, accuracy is seven, crit chance two. Come on. That is four damage. Remember, my, my other chick's too slow. Mm hmm. So, four damage. That's her turn. So, the Vestal loses one of these. I don't know, I ended up with a. I put it there. Oh, copy that. This is one of those, and I move really slow. I go one, two, that's my turn. Mm. So, we all take mm -hmm. two stress. Two stress. We are already in round two, and we've done next to no damage. That was a really bad first round. That was a bad first round. Super bad first round. Hmm. Okay. Level one dungeons were easier. <laughs> you think? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we're level two now. We should be like smoking these dudes. No. I don't think so. Not when you roll like I do. We need to upgrade some damage effects. Okay, here we go. Highwayman is first. And he's in that stance that doesn't do him any good. Could go up but and kill the madman. Maybe. Well, maybe not. Six health left. Or I can beat on that Rattler. One, two, six health left. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try to hit the Rattler again. Okay, right on. Because okay. I want to try to get that two bleed on him. Dodge a two. The hit, go um, the crit. Uh, it's open vein, so no, it's not a crit. So five damage. Unless yeah. you have a bleed. Uh, two gonna... for two. That goes... Did I do yep. that right? No, yeah, you did. Okay. And you need to get a bleed for him. This goes away, too, though. And I need to get a bleed for him, too. Two Just bleed. one turn? Two bleeds no, for two, two turns. No, two turns. There you go. Two bleed, two turns. That's nine damage there. Um, that was one. You can reshuffle. And then, uh, I will put... Good to go? Yep. That's uh, that. Here we go. Crusader's next. All right, Crusader, the Bone Courtier is over there. Madman needs to be taken care of. <clears throat> so, um, well, I do hope I can kill the Man Man this turn, but he's got how much left? Six, six damage. Six. Hmm. He's not oh, unholy, yeah. right? He's not. Oh, it doesn't matter. That's a smite. And not his human. Uh, okay, you think you got him? 
Yeah, or I could throw a bunch of daggers over that way. Well, I think I can take care of the bone cord here on my own because I got to smite one stunning blow. So, um, so this comes off. This comes off. All right, so first off, smite one. And since we'll try again, unless we want a stunning blow, which will stun him. You can stun him. What's the damage difference? Uh, plus one, so it's half damage, really. I can do eight damage with smite one. Or oh, four. Um, oh, no, he is unholy, yeah. I ate to kill him, though. All you gotta do is hit him to kill him. Okay, smite one, then. Yeah. Got it. Okay, there you go. Thank goodness. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna bleed for two. Seven health. Out of how much? 22. <laughs> We're not quite there yet. And he Ooh. is going to want to do that's not a crit. Not yet. He want to do a snake bite against the furthest. Vestal. And she, he wants to be a range of one. So he's going to stop there to make our lives even worse. <sighs> Alrighty. Snake bite. Accuracy 10. So it's an automatic hit, crit chance of two. Okay. That's five damage. That's wonderful. So six, and a bleed for three turns. So two bleed for two turns. Oof. Since she has resistance. For two turns. Okay. Ain't got time to bleed. Yes, she does. <laughs> yes, she does. Okay, Bone Spearman, he wants to do a four. He wants to do an impale against the most crowded room. That's over here. No, oh, no, crowded we're, we're, with we're us. crowded with heroes, yeah, so yeah. we're all equal. So he actually wants to be against the Crusader at a range of one, so he's in a perfect spot. Mm -hmm. Accuracy is nine, so accuracy eight. Good chance three. So that's five damage just to stab. I'm at you death's door. You are at death's door? Yep. <laughs> Great. Wonderful. So here's my four damage. Mm-hmm. All right, Grave Robber's turn. Okay, well, she thought she had this figured out. And then she got a snake. So, he has four. I can't use range against him. Just at try all. to take out the madman. So, pick to the face of the madman. Crit chance two, accuracy seven. That's another four damage. That's eight damage. She doesn't have any more up close and personal attacks. So she's gonna have to throw, what is his immunities? Is he immune? So he's got five out of 15. Um, no armor. So she's gonna throw a poison dart at it? She's gonna throw a... That sounds like a good idea. All right. Poison dart, will start adding that blood. Poison dart on it. Oh, that's With right. a crit. So that'll go down one. That's four damage. Be nice if a crit like doubled the. So he's at nine damage, plus a two blight, three turns. Nice. Okay, that's her turn. Vestal's next. Sparkle fingers on the madman. You sure you don't want me to heal this dude? Can you do both? No. I either gotta walk forward and heal, or I can. Sparkle fingers. He needs a heal, don't he? she? Yeah, I guess so. So I don't have to roll. She needs to bleed for two. 
I need um, I need two ones, please. Okay. All right. So she's gonna walk forward. What the heck's the madman gonna do? Hmm. Well, he's just gonna want to go to the middle. That's his whole goal. All right. So she's gonna walk forward and heal him. Same time, she's gonna heal herself. So. Um, I think, yeah. All right, crit chance four with divine comfort. Yeah. So that's a crit. So hers will go down one. This will go down one. You heal three, and she heals two. Just gets you off death door, but right. Five total. Okay. Nice. Monster's turn. So the madman is in final position. Doesn't matter to him. He wants to do a doomsday against the most crowded space, which is where he's standing. Oh, wait. He don't want to do that. He just wants to hang out here to give us... Remember? He's the last guy in the thing. So his... Yeah, because the monster's here. Yep. He's uh, just but it's, it says that... Instead of doing his instead deal... Instead of doing this stuff... He's just going to hang out. He's just going to move here. Right. Dang. Okay. Well, it's better than attacking us. Well, that's two stress each. Yep. <laughs> Crusader is not enjoying life right now. He is not. <laughs> I'm not sure any of us are. <laughs> uh, round three now. Round three. Three baddies left. Okay, if we don't make this room, we're going back <laughs> we're going, to the hamlet. Well, yeah, we're going home regardless. <laughs> we do not want to go to the stagecoach to find somebody else to help. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna bleed for two. It's nine damage. That is. Is that a five? Yeah. yeah. Nine out of 22. And he wants to do a snake bite against the furthest away. He's just all over the place. This thing's just like shooting around. He's gonna move there. Um, accuracy is eight, crit chance two. That's a hit for five damage. He's a, no, he's not a death door, he's super close. He's one away from uh, death's door. And two bleed, because you're resistant, you get these two bleed for two turns. Um, yeah, this man, yeah. Wow. This is bad news, bears. Okay, hmm. Crusader's turn. All right, Crusader is going to try to open up a can of WA. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. On this uh, rattler. If you could do four damage to that guy, he wouldn't get to smash the high women next. <sighs> How much? Four? You need to do four to him. Take him out. Well, four to him and then he'll bleed or he'll uh, go the blight out. Will kill him. Yeah. All right. I'll zealously accuse him. I was going to stomp on this snake a couple times Just with smite and stunning that. blow, but... All right. Zealous accusation first. Accuracy nine. So seven. Seven. That hits. Hit. So it does five damage. Five? Yeah. So that will finish him off on his turn. Okay. And then, uh, do you want me to do... He's already gone, so stunning blow. I'm just going to do smite one. Um, crit one, accuracy seven. Nice. Yes. Seven damage. Ooh. One, two, three. I'll put him at 16. Uh, 22. That's okay. it. Nice. Uh, I think we'll take it. Nope. No, oh, thank you. Thank you for not consuming more. Yes. Eating a torch. I know. <laughs> Crusaders over in the corner. He's like <laughs> no, walking around, chopping at things yeah. with a a turkey bone in his hand and just chomping. Okay. Oh. Madman goes next. Well, his job is to go to the middle to. Ham for us. So, okay. onto the highwayman. 
All right, Highwaymen. Um, um, I'm not going to do a Duelist Advance. I don't like that. That's a bad idea. Well, I mean, it's not necessarily a bad idea. It it works well with Open Vein. Mm -hmm. It works well with Open Vein. So why don't I try it, see if it works out. Nice. Um, so we'll do Duelist Advance first, 9, Accuracy 9, 8, 7, Crit 2. So I made it. So it's 4 damage on the Rattler. Okay. Let's aim at 20. Gives me 2 repost. Um, a buff. Oh, I gotta take two more damage. Buff for one turn? I'm at Death's Door. <laughs> you are at Death's Door. Um, that would have given me two more. I got a buff. Um, and. 20 health. That, that pulls me up here. Oh, yep. Right on. And then he'll do Open Vein. Wait a minute, how much do you have? Two health. He needs two? Yep. To die? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, should I just use this? Because it gives me plus three. You could. It's I don't know really, what else he's going to do. He's not going to do anything else. Of so, course, if he misses, then yeah, you might as well use it just so you don't miss. I think I will. So let's just kill the snake. Okay, nice. Rebellion. Stupid uh, rattler, man. <laughs> Holy what moly. Was last one? What was the snake the last time? The Pliskin. The Pliskin, yeah. I'll, I'll take a Pliskin it. over a rattler any day. Um, and unfortunately, I don't have. Can I slink back? Sure. Yep. No, you can I'm shuffle sure. as your action. Slink back. <laughs> well. I'm slinking He's, back. He's hurting over here. Are we in round three? Is that correct? Yes. Oh, we are. Okay. All right. So, Grave Robber's turn. Come on, y'all got to take care of the madman now. I think I'm going to go get a chest. What well, do I have? Some money, don't I? All right, fine. Pick in the face. You know. How fun. much money do we have? We've got. We've got twenty-two bucks. Twenty-two bucks. That sucks. All right, fine. 22 bucks in our lives. I think that's worth it. Well, she could possibly kill him. Possibly. <laughs> All right, forget about it. Do it. I'm gonna hit him with a pick. That's a crit, too. Isn't it? That is a crit. Yeah. One stress relief, one stress relief, and seven damage. That's everything. Can we go home now? Yes. <laughs> Please and thank you. Alright, we're going home. We got two we XP out of that. Second XP. Yep. Alright. Snake away. What can we do with this before we leave though? Uh, Anything useful? Two stress relief. Two stress relief? Yep. Um, right there. Well, yeah, one, two. Actually, if we get somebody that doesn't need to heal up in town, do it to this guy, and then we can just Make it a point of pain to get him. One, two? Yeah, why not? Okay, that's it. All right, so we're headed back to town now. Headed to town. We'll see you there. Right on. I beg you, deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadow of the darkest dungeon.